Hi, my name is Krishana Keen. I am a commercial and editorial photographer, which is constantly evolving. <laughs> and today I'll be giving five tips on posing and angles in portrait photography. Tip number one, work with your environment. One thing I find that's really helpful is making my environment my set and using anything that's available to me as my props. I like to utilize the space in a way where I'll position my subjects um, within the environment. One example is using a wall to position someone, um, and if the wall is kind of interesting, I might use composition to position them like, right in the dead center um, and kind of use that environment around them to help with posing them. Tip number two change your perspective. One thing that I find that I absolutely love doing is either coming below my subjects or above, having them sit, um, laying down on the ground. Sometimes those make for amazing photos. Um, and also kind of just allowing your subjects to position their bodies in a way that's like really dynamic, um, kind of reaching towards the lens, capturing hands, or maybe even a kick towards the lens, um, which creates some kind of dimension between you and your subject. Tip number three, don't be afraid to challenge yourself as well as your subjects. One thing that I really like to do is kind of push my limits as a photographer in positioning my body to kind of get those dynamic angles. But I also like to kind of challenge my subjects to just really get crazy with their bodies and bend in ways that they're not used to doing, um, positioning themselves in ways that may feel uncomfortable in the moment, but really, really do look great on camera. So when I'm on set, I kind of just really challenge them. I'm like, put your leg up or, you know, put your arm above your head or bend over backwards. And <laughs> as cliche as that may sound, um, these things kind of really, really do look great on camera. <laughs> Tip number four, pay close attention to details. While on set and while posing people, it's really important to pay close attention to the small details that you may overlook. So anything simple as like hands as someone is posing, some people they kind of get nervous um, and they tend to like kind of do weird things with their hands when they're standing or when you're posing them. So it's really important to just kind of pay attention to those things, clothes, hair, um, the way somebody's feet are angled, you know, paying attention to those things can be really helpful because those things you cannot fix in post. <laughs> Tip number five, direction is key. I've spent a lot of time kind of building a rapport with my subjects and trying to make them feel comfortable in front of the camera. It's really important to kind of build that because people can't see themselves in front of the camera and so they tend to get nervous and kind of clam up. Once you kind of build that level of comfortability, it kind of gives them the freedom and, and boost their confidence to actually want to get into those poses. One, making people laugh, kind of relating to them on camera, you know, letting them know like I'm super shy in front of the camera. So kind of letting them know that I'm shy, it kind of warms them up a little bit, gets them comfortable with me. Sometimes I actually show them the images as I'm shooting to kind of just let them know, like listen, this looks amazing, trust me, I got this, we got this. <laughs> as long as you take my direction, they'll come out great. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope these tips were super helpful. And if you guys have any questions, comments, or concerns, please drop them in the box below and I'll definitely be here to answer any questions that you may have. You can find my work at visualsbyk.com or on Instagram at visualsbyk. Thank you so much.